People in Bemidji came together today to show solidarity and support for the Standing Rock Sioux Nation of North and South Dakota and their resistance to the Dakota Access Pipeline. Around 50 people gathered today to pray and show support for the people of Standing Rock. Standing Rock Tribe says the $3.8 billion pipeline would disturb sacred burial grounds and endanger water supplies at the reservation and the neighboring communities. They have filed a federal lawsuit against the Army Corps of Engineers citing treaties with the U.S. government for failing to comply with environmental and historic preservation laws. Today's group in Bemidji says it goes beyond what is happening at Standing Rock. What we're doing here is not just for Indian people. This is for people from all walks of life. We can't redo this earth thing over again. And so if we contaminate the waters, then what does that leave our grandchildren? That's the question. And so ultimately our treaties are protecting not only Indian people, they're protecting non-Indian people. And so that's what I would like to miss. That's the message I wanted to clarify was that this is for all of us. This is for all of us. And we need, we need non-Native people to stand up as well. Close to 3,000 people have now gathered at protest encampments along the Standing Rock Reservation's border near where the pipeline is slated to cross. People in Bemidji can donate supplies to people at the camp by dropping them off at the American Indian Resource Center at BSU until noon on Friday. A U-Haul with supplies will be leaving on Friday afternoon to deliver the items to the encampment at Standing Rock. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.